today I'm going to show you a little adapter I bought. Uh, I've had it a while, I've ended up with three of them for some reason. So I'm just going to show you what I bought. If you've got one of these, um, instead of big buying the big canisters, you can get these for, I think it's about a pound a tin. Yeah, it's about a pound a tin these are. So if you bought one of these, it's basically butane gas and you can buy one of these adapters these adapters are absolutely <laughs> brilliant so you just take this cap off where the uh, groove is there's another little lug on this bit that goes directly on top of that turn and that's sealed off on what I tend to do with it though is basically you can get some of these where basically it just screws directly on top uh, but it's not going to be practical because with the weight of it if you've got a pan on top of it it's going to wobble either side so what I tend to do is I have it like with these, one of these ones. You could probably you could use it if you put some rocks at the side and stop put some rocks at the side of it, stop it uh, falling over, but or some logs or whatever. I'll show you it on. Now I put this on first. I've got more control of it. Put that on. Well, first the top. That's sealed. And open the legs up on this. Seems like it doesn't want the canister to lie. That's better. So it's away from it. Now, the question is, will the stainless sit nicely on it? Yeah, it does. Put some water in. And lid on. The time is 12.05. Trangier is quite uh, Trangier is quite easy uh, go out, get in, do this, put it back together. But obviously you've got everything in one one bag. So having this set up, you need the gas canister, you need the, the adapters always with me bag anyway, and I've got a butane close by. But having it like this make it a little bit more weight 
but then obviously with the Trangia, if you're out for a couple of days, you're going to need all the fluid with you as well. Same with the gas cartridges. But that little adapter um, works absolutely brilliant. So I'll just see if it's uh, how it boils. Give you bought some of these. Now these for master, and they're only a pound. A pound for eight sachets. A cappuccino. It's been boiling now for three minutes. Now anybody's wanted to know what uh, gas burner I'm using, I'm using the X XT3. It wasn't expensive, and the adapter on the on this that adapter was only uh, about three pound. So three pound and a gas canister for a pound. Once you've got that, you've got it, haven't you? Once you've got this, you've got it. So in a total, two pound. I think that uh, burner is about fifteen pound. You can see it does hold the Stanley Cook set, cook pot on it. One thing good about this is this doesn't get hot. Where with the Trangia, the flames can come up the side, and it does some. You've got to keep adjusting this so it doesn't get the handle hot. So while we're waiting, I'll just fill this up. I know we shouldn't, but we do. A couple of sachets of sugar. <laughs> I wonder where they're from. Now that is boiled. So five minutes to boil. A lot quicker than the Trangia. The other adapter I've got is. Lip guard. Stops you burning your lips. So all in all, we've got Stanley cook set. The Stanley, basically all I've probably used is the pot. Um, the lid come off the Tatonka. Um, Fifteen pound for the XT3, pound for that, I think it was about two pound fifty, it said three pound for that, this was 22 pound for the Nalgene bottle with the slopes, so that's another different way, another different way of setting it up, um, if you don't want to take the uh, Trangia with you or you've got room in your pack to put the gas canister and the adapter, it's ideal. That's nice. Hot, but nice. With that lip guard, it's absolutely brilliant. 
So that's the setup for that. So please give us a like, uh, give us a subscribe, hit the thumbs up, and uh, I'll see what else I can put up for you uh, before we start going proper wild camping. Because we need to go very, very soon. Because you can see behind me, we've been staying in this for a couple of nights. Bit of glamping. So, see you all soon. Bye for now. See you in a bit.